Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math on Ampere algebra problem. So here we have m to the power of n minus n equals to 77 and we solve this problem for the values of m and n and here we have one restriction on m and n is that our m and n must be belongs to a natural number n. Okay, here n capital N be the natural number. It means that we solve this problem for the natural values of m and n only. Okay, so here the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to focus in the exponent of this term so uh, here we multiply the exponent of m uh, is multiply and divide by 2 and here we have this is n minus similarly we multiply the exponent of this n is also multiply and divide by 2 equals to 77 so after that we can apply here the exponent law so uh, according to the exponent law we need to move this n over 2 in the uh, inside the term and it will be written as m to the power of n over 2 and its whole square minus here we again move 1 over 2 inside the term and we write it as uh, n to the power 1 over 2 and its whole square equals to 77. So further in the next step here we need to apply uh, the nice algebraic formula so that uh, here we know this formula if you have a square minus b square it is equals to uh, a minus b times of a plus b. So here if uh, we will take uh, this value is equals to x and this value equals to y so it will be written as x equals to m to the power of n over 2 and y equals to n to the power of 1 over 2. So when you substitute these two values to the above equation uh, so that our above equation is written as x square minus y square equals to 77. So that uh, here we can apply this algebraic formula. So according to this formula we write this term as x minus y times of x plus y and it is equals to 77. So here we need to focus in the uh, left hand side. You see here we have two factors are multiplied by each other but in the right hand side we have only one factor. Uh, so that now first we need to find uh, the product of natural numbers whose equals to 77 so that uh, we have the possible product of natural number which get the 77 are uh, 1 multiplied by 77 equals to 77 77 multiplied by 1 equals to 77 and uh, 1 uh, 11 times of 7 is 77 and 7 times of 11 is also equals to 77 so we have these four possibilities but now here we can uh, choose those possibilities which uh, suitable for our given condition okay so here you see that x minus y uh, if we can make the relation between x minus y and x plus y you see here uh, x minus y is always less than x plus y it means that our first factor is always less than the second factor we choose those possibilities in which the first factor is less than the second factor so here you see that 1 is less than 77 we choose this value here you see that 77 is greater than 1 so we rejected this case here 11 is greater than 7 we rejected this case and 7 is less than 11 so we accept this case so we have these two possibilities uh, so now we can make the two cases here so uh, the first case is that uh, we can uh, choose x minus y equals to 1 and x plus y equals to 77. We write it here x minus y equals to 1 and x plus y equals to 77. This is the first case and the second case is that uh, we choose uh, x minus uh, y equals to 7 and x plus y equals to 11. So we have these two cases uh, so that now first we uh, focus on case number one. So in case number one uh, here uh, we uh, need to find the value of x and y. So if we add these two uh, equations then you see here this is the negative and a positive term are cancelled by each other and we get x plus x equals to 2x 1 plus 77 equals to 78 this implies that x is equals to 78 divided by 2 
so that here we get the value of x is equals to uh, 78 divided by 2 equals to here you see that 2 3s are 6 and 2 9s are 18 so we get here x is equals to 39 and now here uh, in the first case if you can add these values then we subtract the y and now we can put this value of x equals to 39 on any one of this equation uh, then we get the value of y okay so here uh, we put this value in the first equation so we have the first equation is x minus y equals to 1 we put the value of x is 39 minus y equals to 1 and we easily get the value of y equals to 38 so we get our y equals to 38 okay so uh, this is the value of y and this is the value of x so here we back substitute these values we know that uh, the value of y uh, we can put in the start of the problem is n to the power of 1 over 2 equals to 38 so here we get the value of n equals to 38 square so this implies that n is equals to 38 square equals to 1444 this is the value of n and now here uh, this is the value of x and if we back substitute the value of x so the value of x is m to the power of n over 2 equals to 39 so we put this value of n here this is 1444 so when you can put it here it will become m to the power 1444 divided by 2 equals to 39 and we get uh, m to the power of uh, 722 when you can uh, cancel out these terms so you get here 39 so we get the value of m equals to 39 to the power of 1 over 722 so here uh, in the start of the problem we will say that we can find uh, the values of m and n for natural numbers so here you see that this value of m is not belongs to n so that uh, we rejected the first case and now here uh, we need to proceed the second case so now here we copy down the case number two here so uh, our case number two is that uh, x minus y equals to 7 and x plus y equals to 11 so here we can find the values of x and y so now uh, if we add these two equations then we get here 2x equals to 7 plus 11 equals to 18 and we get the value of x is equals to 9 and now here we need to back substitute the value of x and we can uh, take our uh, x is equals to m to the power of n over 2 equals to 9 and we can write our 9 as 3 square so if you compare both of the sides then you get our m equals to 3 and n over 2 equals to 2 so here you have m equals to 3 this is the first natural value of m and here you get n equals to 4 this is the second natural value of m so these are the two natural values of m and n this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos